Here we are back in the review corner. We're looking at a Reliance water jug. It's a seven gallon container, 26 liters. Pretty, pretty durable plastic. Uh, uh, air hole there. If you take this out, you've got the fittings to turn it into the standard kind of cooler setup. I, you just unscrew this from there, flip it to the other side, and and you've got yourself a, a way to drain it out a little slower. What, but what made me buy this one was that it's nice and square. A lot of water containers are thin, and those are great for storage on the side of your Jeep or uh, in a lot of different ways. They are they're, they store a little flatter. But I wanted something that would not be so tipsy tipsy when it was uh, standing up. And this one is nice and a cubicle. It's like a Minecraft block. This thing is roughly the same all the way around. But from left to right here, you can see we've got right around. I'm trying to account for some of the, uh, the edges here that are kind of rounded. But it's right around a foot. And vertically, it's a little taller this way. You can see that. It's, uh, if you count the lid here, it's going to be pretty close to 16 inches. And then from the front to the back here, again, it's it's pretty close to a foot. And I would I would measure it exactly, but uh, it does kind of have a. If we look at the top here, it does have a little bit of curvature to it. And the material does flex, so I would call it a safe foot to uh, get the measurement. This is what the base of it looks like. And again, it looks like it's been molded together from two pieces up for the bottom here. And I definitely would look at these in the store and just make sure you don't see any pinhole leaks in there. Um, I haven't had any problems at all with these, so... I've used it just a few times. We've got some other seams here, but uh, we've also got this uh, measurement tool here. So if you were to set this on its side, presumably you could see through this enough to uh, know how much water is in there. I never, never even noticed that before, but it does have that on both sides. On this side, it is liters and on the other side we've got gallons so it's a seven gallon container, and that's uh if you fill up every single part of it because as you can see it's six gallons on its side right there but if you were to tip it up like i was using it uh, all of this stuff is hollow in there so you could fill it up to seven gallons no problem that is the reliance aquatainer seven gallon Pretty handy to have around. We took it on uh, road trips and, and that kind of thing. You never know when you're going to need some water. Um, you can put potable water in here. Sometimes your car needs water. I mean, water is a pretty important thing to have around. If I was going to put this on the side of a vehicle, I might get something a little tougher because it is. It does. Uh, let's see if I can get it to move here a little bit. It does, it is pretty tough. I have no complaints about the toughness of this for what it's for, but if you're gonna bang it around camp and beat it up a little bit, you might want something a little bit thicker than that. Um, but not bad. Very, very good value for your money there. And you've got seven gallons of water. That's, a, that's an easy choice. Almost everything else is gonna be more expensive. Oh yeah, there you go, the Reliance Aquatainer.